It is that time of year again. Tickets will go on sale this morning for the two cars, two winners raffle. The St. Francis Foundation raises money for women's, children's, and critical care services at the hospital. And that's where we find our Jessica Torcelli right now live. Good morning. Good morning, Jasmine. We are so excited to be here at St. Francis Medical Center. I'm joined by Ami Kane with the St. Francis Foundation. Good morning. Thank you for being here. Thank you for having us. So we're talking about something very <coughs> exciting. And right behind this sign, that is the NICU. And of course, a lot of the funding goes right back to the NICU. Tell me why it is so important to raise money for services here at the hospital. So as you know, we have the only level three in ICU in this region. And that's really critical for all of our babies, not only here in Monroe and Washtenaw Parish, but in our entire area that we care for. And so when you're giving back, you're really giving back to those most in need. When you think about those premature babies that are in such need of an opportunity to have a good start in life, really, right. is when you think about it. And so really our dollars are going back into the hospital to make sure that we can provide those services moving forward. And so people don't have to drive that further distance exactly. to Jackson, Shreveport, wherever they may have to Stay go. Stay here close to home. Right. Yes. And absolutely. women's critical care and children's services, all of that is lumped into this. All of that is. So we have a level three um, OBED. Um, which is one of the first of the kind in the region, which we're very proud to have here. <clears throat> we're probably seeing about 350 women each month through wow. that OBED, which is an amazing opportunity to be able to get that care straight right when you walk into the door, not go through our normal ER, um, and really get the care that they need at that time in their life. So it's really been very um, exciting to be able to add that kind of service. And then, of course, we have a level two PICU. Mm -hmm. <coughs> Excuse me, got a frog in the throat this morning. Yes. Um, level two PICU, which really cares for our babies, uh, not only our babies, but also going into the you know younger adult um, ages. And it's really a great opportunity for us to be able to have Services close to home so you don't have to be separated from your child because that's really important. We recognize there's so much anxiety that really surrounds all of that. And being able to be right here at home to be able to have that care is really important for us. Right, and your dollars go right back to your community. It may be a member of your family who needs yes. to rely on these services. But you can do your part by buying a ticket, and that is this morning. That kicks off today. You can. You can buy that ticket. Actually, for the um, we have an early bird special yes. this year. So until um, August 9th, you can get your tickets and actually have a chance to win $5,000 from the Creighton create early birth special and of course as you can see on here we've got two new cars this year we're doing the Nissan Frontier and mm -hmm. the Toyota Highlander so a little bit different this year to try to change up a little bit of things and try something new so eight years of this we've been yeah. very successful and very fortunate to be able to have so many people support this and the services that we offer here in our region thank you so much for joining us we're gonna have thank more you. information yes. throughout the morning show and also on Thursday morning starting next week we're gonna have stories about families who relied on these very services back to you Jasmine